kal halal yum la yahawa bahasham shal yahawa shai double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstones and salutations the elect that is pushing the truth of the scriptures in sincerity and truth out there you now so I'm here working on this uh, this stencil you know yahawa name ya ha wa and the ha the end and the connector should be there and yahawa shai and yasharala and, those, and these precepts you know came to mind thinking that you know like according to Baruch 4 and 28 we should be um we should be you know push ourselves 10 times more I mean you know some brothers got some other gifts and talents that the Haoba Hashem Yoshai gave, gave us and you know we were using for the wickedness of this world so what's the what's the difference why why is it that we can't use these same gifts and talents for, for the for the kingdom for edify the elect you know i mean don't get it don't get it twisted it's not i'm saying that you know some brothers who are out there rapping and making videos and stuff like that and when you get some leisure time you know if you used to draw or you used to graphic design or or some other thing do it for the glory of your howl by shimmy all right my young the one of the young brothers in this camp named uh, Bardania. You know he he passionate about the Hauba and Shimmy Oshai and he asked me, you know, if we could put the name of Yahweh Wai Yahweh Shai on a massage massage that he kinda made. It's not a sash uh, a head tie, sorry. So you know the spirit got on me if I can make this stencil for the brother. And um, you know these precepts come to mind that you know we wish we wish if you know we were still in the kingdom you know we can't imagine how we used to be in the kingdom but you know these scriptures as a reminder according to Malachi three sixteen a book of remembrance was written before them that thought upon the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai roughly paraphrasing I know uh, and this my, this scripture came to mind you know as I was you know doing this uh, Deuteronomy six verse seven to nine and thou shalt teach them diligently unto thy children. And thou, sh and thou shalt talk of them when thou sittest in thine house. So, you know, back in the day, we used to teach us to our children. And, you know, and we used to talk of them when we sit in the house. When when thou walkest by, when we on the on the road, when thou liest down, when we lie down with our wives or even by ourselves. And when thou risest up, when we wake up, thou shalt bind them for a sign upon thine hand. And they shall be as frontless between thine eyes. Now look how far we've fallen. Now, now, now people are more, more excited about other brand names that don't even pertain to the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. And us, you know, the sincere men out there, love the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai so much that you know we, you know, we want to profess that name throughout all the ages. Right, verse nine, and thou shalt write them upon the posts of thy house and upon thy gates. And you know, me being a man who's um, gifted in art and so forth, wish that I could have painted my walls with with the Hebrew scriptures of the of the uh, of the Holy Word, you know. But this is how far we've fallen. This is the limitations we're. we're we're set to when we had the privilege of doing so. You know, like the scripture says in uh read second as just eight, when we had the liberty, cast away the word of Yahweh by Hashem Shai. But you know, the scripture said there had to be a fallen away first and so forth, but I miss. Yeah, I can safely say I miss when we when 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 we had a chance to do Yahweh by Hashem Shai will. And this, you know, this is teaching us to appreciate the gift, the gift of the knowledge of this understanding, of this, of this peace, of this joy that we feel when we do Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai will. You know, I got another scripture here. This is um, Exodus 35, 35. Them that, them hath he filled with wisdom of heart, you know, wisdom of heart. It pertains to mind, you know, and, and it, uh, you know, when when I use the word heart, it means like 
the the connection you know the appreciation I use the word heart like this is this is this is what would it's like your heartbeat so to speak but you know his mind is referring to but the how about you know which is poetic you know when he when he, when he wrote these words when he gave these words then he had filled with the with with wisdom of heart to to work all manner of work he says all manner of work that's why jake is the salt to the sea salt to the earth okay <laughs> salt to the earth the light to the world like all manner of work anything anything our hands touch you know anything our hands touch it all for the glory of Yahweh or Shai and or should say it all should be for the glory of Yahweh and you know we do it we do it different from every other nation every, that's better and different than the so-called heathens um, so-called so-called East Indians Chinese Edomites which is so-called white race etc you know the most I didn't give you this gift we sit on it and so forth you know so yeah, yeah like I said I just miss <laughs> miss the days when 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 um then we had things right but you know even Ecclesiastes say hey don't don't complain why the former days has passed roughly paraphrasing let me finish off here eh? to work all manner of work all manner of work of the engraver and of the cunning workman and of the embroider see and of the embroider in blue and in purple and in scarlet and in fine linen and the weaver even of them that do any work and of those that devise cunning work cunning work means like stuff very innovative you know as i'm working on this stencil here, giving glory to the name yahweh why yahweh shai and also teaching our people that our name is yasharala prince of the power in the paleo hebrew you know just got transparency transparency stencil here to apply on t-shirts and you know something we like to do on, on leisure time rather than the graphic design just to think on just think on the name just to think on the name hoping that you know you how about shimmy or shake don't take his light from 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 us you know hopefully like to exhort brothers you know Mind brothers, yeah, this is the power of the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Another thing too is that you know the wicked of this world, they're doing they're doing things to the best of their ability, and they think they're doing good. So we that know better, why not do the will of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai? Can't let them outshine us, you know. You just gotta do Yashirala. Should be good here. Can't let them outshine us, you know. All right, let me just get a quick precept here. Another precept come to me. I like reading this one. In. Um, I think it's First Peter. Yeah, First Peter three and seventeen. For it is better if the will of Yahweh. Be so that ye suffer for well doing than for evil doing, you know. Best of we suffer doing doing the right thing. I mean, you know, my 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 worldly dream or my worldly goal was to start a clothing line and you know put put um put things on t shirt that are that are um spiritually unprofitable that would have destroyed my people even worse, you know. Yeah, I might probably do one, two things pertaining to the most high. But then you know, I gave up that dream. For you know, something more more profitable. And scripture says he that um gave up everything in this world. For your how bashim your shai's will.
So now we shall receive a hundredfold or through paraphrasing. Give up lands, wife, children, dreams, goals. Shall receive a hundredfold plus eternal life. You know, so you're gonna enjoy that for all eternity. You know, yeah, how we got a got a big home coming gift waiting for his people, the so-called Negroes, Amerindians, Latinos, Hispanics, Native Americans, and confusion of faces, the Israelites that look like the heathens, you know. The other nations. Mm. And when, when, when doing things like this, it excites you, you know. Are you thinking in the kingdom? Me wearing garments with Yahweh name and the glow of the glow of the glory of Yahweh by Hashem Yashai is on you. And you can see these these jewels and these riches and whatnot light up by the glory of Yahweh by Hashem, not by battery and them stuff like that, you know. Just gotta push ourselves, you know, push ourselves in these last exhorting one another. Whatever way. The spirit come on you for do. As long as it doesn't get in the way of reading the word, teaching the word and so forth. You ain't good. You know? And your brother's saying that, you know. But I'm saying, well, yeah, in a way, saying because actually speak louder than words. You know, I'm trying to push this through to the best of my ability because you know, I hate the man I am and I want to be the man Yahweh Bashim Yahushai want me to be. You know, one thing I seek for is honestly is to hear Yahweh Bashim Yahushai say. Well done, good and faithful servant. Well done. Endure to the end. You know, you just gotta keep doing the works. Doing the works. Doing the works. When you think about the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. How long they've been doing it and they ain't complaining you need to complain to complain in, in silence you know your spirit your spirit groans and get frustrated at how at how some men just come and go like if like if I guess they, they, they really didn't understand what I really get themselves into because this is this is truly living Doing the right thing is true living. And, and apparently, like people got their own interpretation was the right thing. Cause I don't know who would want to fall out of this truth. The scripture say, "Great peace have they which keep keep thy law, and nothing shall offend them." There's um. Psalms 119, verse 1, 6 to 5. You know? I'm just gonna finish up this ten slay in this end this video. So it's lucky if I might seem like rambling, but I hope that this video is edifying. fine. The spirit has gotten me you know, to do a video while cut no this stencil. Some brothers might do videos on, on nutritional stuff. Some brothers might do videos on historical stuff. Some brothers might do videos on like music, movies. It's a lot of topics, you know. You just gotta let the spirit. Just gotta abide with the spirit, you know. Getting them scriptures. Salvation is nearer than we ever believe, you know. All these things are going on, like for example, the free trade um that's going on with Africa. That's preparing the way to mark the beast, the one world, one dollar thing. All the African nations, uh, so-called Africa, I should say, 
except Nigeria and South Africa are signing these treaties so far. I believe it's a uh, far six. Far six African nations signed it so far. You know. So I'm making the way for the one one currency thing. I believe it um uh, the report in Al Jazeera Al Jazeera of it now. It said somewhere along the line. That it can be a one currency free trade between these nations. But a guy did mention when he was doing the interview with these you know like trade trade specialists, I don't know what he's called them. He did mention the elites, the world elites and so forth. That he don't support it because they're playing right into the hands of the world elites, so, you know, in that type of context. This is why the certain true spirit he how about Shim Yoshai, the guy was saying. Yeah, because the world elites own everything, buddy. People don't understand. They don't know how these man is move. These man got these man been planning years. These men fifty years ahead. As the scripture said they're wise to do evil. They're wise to do evil. They lay up in their beds, according to Michael. The plan we don't follow the nations. As the scripture says, Woe unto you have to lay down up in your beds, devising evil. Or if you try to phrase him, leave us Micah 2 and 1. Almost done here. I'm trying to hurry up and damage it. Yeah. Okay, I remember when when I was a Christian and all too. I used to write um, serve Jesus today or some shit like that on, on, on all the money that I got so that people could turn to the Mosai. <laughs> now, Yahweh Bashem Yosha using the same zeal, the same energy the right way. Like Acts 17 and um, Acts 17, 17 and 30. At the time of ignorance, Yahweh Bashem Yosha wink at, but now called all men. To repentance, you know. So this is Yahawa on the connector. Ha, Yahawa Shai connector. There's an I and as a Sha. And this is Yah Sha Ra Allah. Yah Sha Allah. Yeah. You know, so like so. I'm gonna take it and some paint. Put it on this garment here for my brother at tie. It's gonna fit like that. Right? And then at the end, the end with the fringes. Let's lock it. With the fringes. I'm gonna put on the right hand side of course. Um Yahawashai. And then on the other end, I put Yasharalo, sorry, Yasharalo. Yeah, so with that, you know, all this lessons with that fine. Um, double honesty, the apostles and elders of Great Mills and Great Mill Stone, and of course, all honesty, Yahweh, Yahweh, Ba Sham, Yahweh Shai, Shalom, Brakata.